Hey everybody, this is Bjorn from WP Learning Lab, and in this video I'm going to show you how to activate the various themes that you may have already installed in your WordPress site. So here we are in the WordPress dashboard. To get to your themes area, all you have to do is hover over Appearance and then click on Themes. And here you see all of the themes that are currently installed on the site. Some of them have updates available, some of them don't, some of them are premium, some of them are from the free repository. But if you want to activate a theme, you can tell which one's active because it has the gray bar at the bottom and it's the very first theme in the top left corner. All the other ones have a white bar. When you hover over them, you have two options, activate or live preview. And there's no harm in activating a theme because what WordPress does, the newest version of WordPress, the theme settings that you set in your theme, those are saved in the database. So if you deactivate your theme, those settings still exist. So if you want to go back to the way you had it, you just activate that theme you deactivated and then your site is back to how it was before. So there's no danger in trying out different themes because you can always switch back and forth because the your theme settings are still in the database and they're still safe. So we have currently the Aveda theme installed and here's how the home page looks. Just the stock demo content for the Aveda theme that you see. So now if we want to activate a different theme, we want to activate Good News, we just click on Activate. And we go back to the home page, refresh the page, and we can see the new theme is activated and looks very different than the other one. And if we want to activate, say, the 2015 WordPress theme, we just click on Activate. It moves up to the top left with a gray bar so you know it's active. We go to the home page. And this is how this theme looks. And you can switch back and forth between themes. If you have a high traffic website, I don't recommend you do it on your live site. I, re I recommend you have a testing environment. If your website's brand new, then it doesn't matter. You can do it on the live site because there's nobody really there yet. So you can play around on the live site and figure out which theme suits you best. Uh, but really, like I said, there's no danger in flipping around between themes. Even if you, if you activate a theme that breaks your site, just activate the one before that that didn't break your site and everything is good again. And you can delete the one that broke it. So I hope this video helps you. My name is Bjorn Allpass in OEP Learning Lab. Make sure you subscribe and follow us and check out wplearninglab.com where we write about WordPress every single day. Talk to you soon.